Hello guys and ladies, this is Prima Milk. Here we have uh, the 3D isometric presets. First of all, you have to install the presets that you find on the folder inside the in your program. So you have to put them on on the version of After Effects you want. You get inside presets and you drag and drop these presets, you find copy here. So inside here you can find how to install the presets on Windows and Mac. And after that you open the After Effect. And let's see how it works. First of all, you can bring a, either a composition or a solid layer or a text, whatever. And you just, on effects and presets, you're searching for premium milk. Just write premium milk and you will find these premium milk presets here. And double click on the layer you want, like this. We have the four axes of isometric and also we have just the 3D effect. And when you put that, that you can change three, three things. First of all, you can reduce the, the extrude like this. One, two, three and more. You can change the brightness of the shadow of the extrude, excuse me, so you can put it light if you want or more dark or sorry, or more dark and also you can change the 3D effect angle but it will not work correctly it's already made for you if you want to change this to another, you have to select all these and again double click excuse me, on the isometric you want front left, front right, top left, top right. Let's see some examples now. Uh, you can do it on a on a map like this. You can do it, uh, you can have a lot of icons and do something like that. Okay. The animation is still existing inside the composition, you don't have any problem. On a bubble, like this. Here we have a login on a target. You can select either two layers or more and double click like this. And then if you want to change one of them, let's say the animated text, we want it less extrude, you can put it on one or on two. You can move it and you can have also the animation that you have inside here let's see it on quarter let's see it on full the render is quite fast, it's, it's okay so this is it how it works You can, so you can do it on a text, just ch change the extrude you want because maybe if it's small you need less extrude. If something is big like this, let's say it's like this, you want three extrude or two maybe to become better. You can do it on a composition that is more complex like this it works correctly and also you can do it on a 
something like that also nice here is a, another icon and also you can do it let's see on a on a mobile excuse me like this this on the mobile you need more let's put it 10 okay and on the icons I need two excuse me let's see the result like this okay so it works only also in infographics let's render a little here it is okay this is it i hope you like it don't forget to rate thank you very much